So sometimes when I'm using the quad cortex, after a while I try to force myself to use some of the features that I don't use very often, just to try something different and to see what I can come up with. So this preset is kind of an extension of that. So there's a couple of things going on here that I don't typically do. One, I'm getting all my gain from an amp model. And I know that might sound normal, but I typically like to stack gain. And so most of my presets, if you've checked them out, you'll notice you'll have kind of an edge of breakup amp, and then I'll put a gain stage in front of that, like a overdrive pedal or a capture. And then I might even put a one in front of that. So sometimes I'll even stack three gain stages. And I like to do that to kind of, that's how I like to build up my gain. So for this one, I just want to stick with, just get my gain from the amp. And what I chose is I'm actually using the Lone Star, which I know doesn't sound very unusual for me, but but I discovered recently that although I use the Lone Star a lot, and I actually did a whole video about that, I use the Lone Star Clean a lot. I don't typically use the drive. And so I was gotten into this by playing around after some of the videos recently around Robin Ford Stumble, and he was on that pedal show. I was like, all right, I want to try to get some drive from an amp like that. And the Lone Star is the closest thing on the Quiet Cortex to a Dumble. So that's what led me into using the Lone Star. And what I'm doing here is I've got two of them running. I've got the 100 watt Tweed, and I'm running that parallel with 100 watt Normal. And so I'm just kind of mixing the types of amp just to fill it out a little bit. So you can see for the Tweed, I've got the drive set rather low, and I'm pushing the gain. On the Normal, I've got the drive and gain about the same. Um, we're pulling the bass back. You know, the Lone Star can always get boomy on the bass side, so I'm always pulling that back. Pushing mids, treble a little bit, and then the presence a little bit. And I'm running the normal in thick mode, and I'm running the tweed in thicker mode. And those are both running through a dual IR I've got. These are from Amalgam. These are part of the free pack. The Fender 2x12 G12 mix, and the Fender VFSR EV12 mix. So just those amps on their own sound like this.
for today's video, like you saw in the opening, I'm playing a Les Paul style guitar. Right now I'm on the neck, I switch to the bridge. And this was the tone in kind of the first kind of solo section where I was just kind of playing the. That was this scene. And you can see this, all the scene is doing is you've got the two amps in parallel through the IR. And on the back end, I've got a plate lush reverb running into an analog delay. And so it's pretty straightforward, but I think it sounds really nice. It works really nice with this Les Paul style guitar. And then I have a scene that's just taking that and adding a compressor on the front of it. Um, I wouldn't use this scene for this guitar. Um, this is something I would do if I was trying to use this more for kind of a strat style guitar that I want a little bit more of a push, a little more sustain out of the single coil pickups. Uh, but we can hear what it sounds like. <laughs> It's just adding a little bit there. And then let's skip over to the scenes over here. So I have a lead tone where all I'm doing is I'm upping the gain on the amp models. So you can see I push the gain here, eight and a half, eight and a half, and this one's seven and a half, seven and a half. And it sounds like this. Just more gain, and then I've got a version of that again with the compressor on the front. And this is the main lead tone you heard uh, during the opening playing. And then we get into the kind of semi-funky stuff. So um, first let's go to this one. So I'm turning on, I've got a MX Vibe on, and you see I got the mix at 100%. Um, you heard this tone in the opening playing, but it was in the background as kind of a rhythm. So speed's about 45%, depth is at 60, so just, just kind of a nice uh, tremolo kind of thing. And then I also have a Love Me filter on here. So it's kind of giving a wah kind of effect. And you heard this specific scene in the part that's going. So kind of that almost an auto wah kind of thing, but and I've got the blend at three and I've got the intensity at about six. So the intensity is rolled back just a little bit, just so it makes the part a little more discernible. And then I've got a scene where I'm doing that same thing, but I'm doing it to that lead tone. So again, just more gain on it. So that was kind of the end lead part you heard. And then this one, I've got the Love Meet on with the MX-5. And this is on the kind of the lower gain sound. So this was the opening riff where I'm doing that. So I think that's an interesting combination. 
And when I tried it out, it was kind of cool and it's kind of led to that riff. <laughs> Kind of the, you know, with the envelope filter on the front, giving it kind of that wah tone and then the vibe on the back with a little modulation going on there. So I had fun playing around with this. Uh, I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, as always, I'll put this preset out on the Cortex Cloud. The link's in the description. Feel free to go check it out. Let me know what you think in the comments below. And as always, thanks for watching.